Here we have the 2013 M case. Meow. MMW sealed case. This is the assortment that's going to basically uh, be appearing June 2013. These are the international, so it's going to be a multi language on the cards. It's not going to say a new models or whatnot. We're not going to have the uh, treasure hunt designation on the package if there is a treasure hunt. And I see one already. Don't know if it's going to have uh, supers or not. Treasure hunts and supers are random. You have no guarantee of them being in a case. But the one you're going to be looking for is that one right there. There's your basic treasure hunt. You got your uh, fire stopper. A fire stopper. What's it? Not fire stopper, is it? Fire eater. There's your uh, tre basic treasure hunt for the MK series. Right here. Got the uh, circle flame logo. Somebody asked me on one of my vid videos, is the uh, treasure hunt symbol ever on the top or whatnot? So far for 2013, the uh, treasure hunt symbol has only been on the uh, side of the model. But that doesn't mean that it's always going to be. I don't know. We're uh, getting near the end as far as treasure hunts go. We have the uh, Plymouth Barracuda Flames. That's a carryover from the uh, previous mix. Hey, Bubba. I think uh, I think we had quite a bit of you already. Oh, I'm glad to see the bump around. That was a fun model. I never did find any on the pegs. I only got one in the case, the red one. This blue one's kind of interesting, color-wise. Hopefully I get a couple in here because I want to send one through the boosters. It does say track stars on there. I want to send one through the boosters. Uh, and since I didn't get that, uh, I only got a couple of the red ones, I didn't get a chance to send it through the booster. Hopefully I get a few in here to give them a trip around the track. Let's get some uh, fantasy stuff out of here. Dragon Blaster been out already for a while. This is not the first appearance for 2013. Shark Cruiser. I think this is a new color. It's kind of interesting. I'm in looking at it. It looks like the wheels. I wonder if we're going to get uh, all small wheel variations. I've seen pictures online. It looks like some people might have all, all small wheels. Keep an eye out for that if you like to collect the uh, variations. There you go, clear wheels, second color version. I'm taking out ones. Mm, I think this color's already been out for the uh, 62 Chevy. Already in my other videos, but we'll give you a quick look for some of you guys who are new. Thanks for subbing, by the way. Thank you for subscribing. I'm getting over 4,000 new subscribers a month. So sometimes people will say, uh, why do you show that car again? Well, you know what, because 4,000 new subscribers every month. So that means maybe some of my uh, new people haven't seen some of this old stuff. I mean, we're regulars. I got regulars. Just, uh, so just sit tight, and I'll get through the stuff that's uh, been older already. Surf Crate. Here you have the uh, Surf Crate in uh, yellow. I like this one better than the other purple color. Here you have the second colorway of the new models speed box. Uh, I like the other one better. But this one's pretty good. I like it. But I definitely like the other one. Maybe because I'm partial because it looks uh, red, white, and blue. The other release. Oh yeah, glad to see this guy back. Acura NXS. NSX. I might have said it right the first time. I'm not sure. Yep. Great model. Fantastic. Works in the boosters. Excellent on the track. And, um, you know, the real model, real car. Track stars up on the top there. Combi in white. Oh, look at that package. A little crunched on the side there. Squished in. I don't know if you guys have gotten a chance to see this yet. It does seem to have a little bit of metal flake in the paint. I could be mistaken. 
quite a, quite a few people have had combis with uh, this stripe on here kind of busted up uh, because it rubs I guess on the blister or something ratified been out already in previous cases same exact model I do believe couple Dodge chargers everything looks alright no tampo work on the front or back you just got the you got the tampo on the stripe tampo on the hood so you know got a bit of ta extra tampo work on there hello where's my lights I'm trying to get out of my uh, lights bum, 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 bum. oh yeah newest color of the Honda 2000 S2000 sorry mixed wheels and let's see yep mixed wheels so yeah that's correct very nice uh, glossy red got another NSX showed you diesel boy been out for a little while already what's this white one we have the uh, 70 roll runner that one's already been out for at least a mix or two got the 71 Plymouth Road Runner and the 10 Ford Shelby GT500 Super Snake that's a mouthful check out the interior let me see if I can get it without getting clear you see right here you can see the color so that's the color of the interior so it looks kind of funny right there but when you look at it here uh, it looks kind of cool very slick kind of nice color for an interior yep. I don't know if I'm going to get it You'll have to check it out in person. It's kind of neat. It's got like a silky look to it. So one basic treasure hunt. Right off of the top. Lotus Project. M250. Porsche 918 Spider. In uh, 71 Dodge Challenger. Been in the mix for a while I believe. I like that one. Got a headlight tampos. Got a tampo on the tail there. Spider. Can't read the small part, but it should say 918, of course. Hey, quick and sick. Came out in red. Now we got it in blue. Hmm, tough decision. Which one I like better? Both of them look fantastic. Hello again. Is this the same one or did I have two? I got two. Here's a new model. We'll put this one come up next. Chicane for those people in the accelerators. Track stars. Uh, I'm sure uh, we got some uh, younger collectors who are going to want to pick up that chicane. And then we got the So Fine. Been out already. Thanks for letting me know it's not a fantasy. It's actually based on a real model. So fine and quick and sick. Got another one. So fine, sweet. Very nice presentation on that guy. Beautiful. All three of these are very nice. And here's a uh, brand new model. Hey, track stars. Come to the right place, Bubba. We're going to have to send you through the loops and stuff. Test you in the boosters. You got the uh, MIG rig. Designed by Larry Wood. I got to see a prototype when I went to the Indianapolis uh, Collectors Convention. Does look like a, a plastic body, but you know, it's a track car, so you don't want to. <laughs> this thing, if it was top heavy, if it was all metal, definitely would uh, have problems going through the loops, that's for sure. Or I should say, going through the curves. Um, Looks pretty good. Now, if you're a customizer, uh, you probably wanted this to come out with a metal body. But um, this one looks like it's going to be for uh, for playing around for fun. There's another one on the bottom right-hand corner. Mm -hmm. There's a new model in the bottom left. Rat mo oh, geez, three of them. Beautiful. Two in the two in the bottom, one in the top. 
Camaro. Yeah, like uh, like you guys were telling me that a lot of them have this uh, interior kind of popping up. Yep, kind of sits a little high. Ratmobile looks pretty good in white. <laughs> pretty nice, uh, pretty nice tampos on the eyes and the ears. Ears are, might be a little off for the placement. I'm not sure, but the eyes look pretty good. Three window 34. Well, let's start off with the custom 12 Ford Mustang. Three window 34 up second. And on the bottom, we have the uh, Chrysler 300C Hemi. Love that car. Love those bling bling wheels. I think I'm going to crack one open and show you how shiny it is. Three window 34. Yeah, it's been quite a few years since I've seen one in the basics. Used to come out all the time. When I was collecting in 1998, started in 98, pretty much was out uh, all the time. Especially it was like a silver with uh, flames. Seemed to come out quite a bit. This is probably part of the uh, graffiti series. Got the uh, graffiti on the side. But I, I love those wheels. Let's give them a spin real quick. Shiny. I wasn't spinning them fast. I was just trying to show you how uh, shiny. Toyota Celica, already been out for a while. Bulletproof, brand new. Reminds me of Nerve Hammer. What do you guys think? Surf's up bus. And uh, I didn't get a chance to check. How long has this been called the Surf's up bus? I thought it was the uh, surfing school bus. Or am I uh, mistaken? Check it out. They gave, gave it an X-Racer treatment on the fenders there. Clear plastic. This already been out for a while. Quick, goodbye. Bulletproof. Who sings that song, Bulletproof? Bulletproof. Kind of similar to Nerf Hammer to me, but maybe, maybe not all that. I wonder if they're always going to put these uh, target symbols on the side with it being uh, called Bulletproof. Very interesting, interesting model. It has like a roll cage inside. So you have the X-Racer body. Wow, this is pretty interesting now that I look at it. So it's basically red plastic. And then it looks like this part's painted, the white part, to give it kind of like some uh, texture. But inside, you, it looks like a roll cage inside. But the, and the whole body, hmm, that, it doesn't pop off or anything. That's very strange. Because look, they got white, they have white tail lights. It can't be two pieces, or is the, uh, or is there multiple pieces? Okay, I gotta look. Hmm. And then the way it's mixed right here, almost looks like they do like coal mold, where it has two types. That's enough. Sorry, guys. You're gonna have to hang around. What's up with this? Is that paint? Or is there a separate piece of plastic? There's definitely a roll cage on the inside. Hmm. I don't. I don't uh, drill pop my cars, but maybe if someone does, this is look. This is some type of co mold with the uh, plastic. They they co molded like a a white with that because look at when you look on the inside. I, get back here. Hey, get back here. I popped this open and on the inside I could see white. Very strange. I should uh, ask Mattel. Because look, look, you look in the fender, you can see white. You can see white. This thing's very strange. Something's going on. There must be a... Uh... That's enough. Something's going on. I gotta shoot somebody an email because it's uh, very strange. Snow ride, not one of my favorites. I like my cars to have uh, wheels. But uh, there we have a... Uh... Porsche 19 Spider. That's not the same Porsche as before, was it? Yep, same one. I had my cars all stacked up all nice. Now they're all toppled over. That was already on top. Come on, how many?
Corvette Stingray was already out in the previous releases, previous case assortments. Somebody asked about Fast and Furious being on the uh, International. Yes, it is. Uh, Fast and Furious on the International. I don't know about the uh, short cards, though. Another uh, Lotus. I think the Challenger was on top as well. Dodge Charger Daytona. Almost kind of got a, uh, a Fool's Gold uh, Super Treasure Hunt look. When the Super Treasure Hunts first came out, they kind of had that thick kind of look. Nah, not a big fan of that that for the supers but uh, that's what it had comparison everything's the same I didn't notice anything another one another one hey shark cruiser I could have used this guy for my review I could I did this a uh, matchbox review I should open it up excuse me excuse me Packages? What packages? Oh, he's too wide. Oh yeah, you know what I did? I uploaded this video of this uh, this Matchbox toy right here, and it's got the crane. And I forgot to show the interior, so you guys, you guys are gonna get to see the interior. Got a little octopus. Got uh, some type of uh, porpoise or something that's supposed to be, and then some seaweed, some sea stars on the back. So sorry if, to the match got, Matchbox guys when I forgot to show that. Yes, Batmobiles, thank you. Can't find the Batmobiles. I can find that uh, Pagani, is it? I can find I can find the Pagani and the stars, but the bat stores, but the Batmobiles, forget it. Okay, they're just plumb being uh, picked up, and I totally understand because. Uh, I'd, uh, I'd be picking them up too. Three? Come on, I don't need triples. It's not no new model or anything, is it? It's just a Fast and the Furious. I'm sure it'll sell out. Everybody's looking for uh, Fast and Furious models. It might be uh, all that right now, but in a couple of years, you know, if you don't find it now, you'll be able to get it off somebody for a buck or so. Don't panic. Oh, down to the last. Uh, Six. I see nothing. I guess see a new model. We'll leave that there. Baja Bone Shaker Blue already out. Stock car already out. Corvette Stingray. Duplicate from this case. And here we have the uh, Volkswagen Scirocco. Nice fun model to have in the assortment. And here's a uh, new model. Hmm. Small parts, not for children under three years. So I wonder if that turret accidentally can pop off. There you go. Turbo turret. Let's take a look at the tampos. They look the same. So it pretty much there's no randomization of the uh, tampos. No track loop symbol on the bottom. So it might not be a track car. Plastic base. Plastic base, metal body. Let's go ahead and check out that turret. Thanks as always for watching, subscribing, liking, sharing, all that stuff. Appreciate it. Helps me uh, grow the channel and continue uh, providing these presentations. Thanks a bunch for watching and good luck searching for the treasure hunt. I did not get a super, but uh, good luck in your travels. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.